Hello, I'm David Norman, Managing Director of D Solar, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we are at our first ever SunGrow installation, and you may have never heard of SunGrow, but all of that is about to change in the next few months. So SunGrow was founded in 1997 in China. To put that into some perspective, Give Energy started in 2012, SolarEdge started in 2006, Grow what started in 2011 and SIG Energy started in 2022. So SunGrow isn't just experienced, they are one of the most established global brands on the market. In fact, they are the largest inverter manufacturer globally with most of their systems powering utilities. And if they're powering utilities, then they'll be more than adequate for home. So currently, one in three inverters globally that are installed are a SunGrow inverter. Let that sink in. And with that said, they haven't even scratched the UK market. So SunGrow established herself in the UK in 2014. They have over 85 staff in the UK and are based in Milton Keynes. So yes, they're here and now they're ready to make their impact in the UK market. And that's why we're here today. So stick around as I take you through our full SunGrow installation here in sunny St Albans. And uh, yeah, let's go and have a look and we'll go and show you everything we've done. So what does SunGrow have to offer? SunGrow systems range from two kilowatt all the way up to 8.8 .8 megawatt. So offering incredible scalability from residential to large homes to businesses all the way up to utilities. With over 605 gigawatt of solar installed over 170 different countries, SunGrow is a true global leader in solar energy. And now a tiny piece of that global landscape can be found here today in sunny St Albans. So what have we installed? Let's start with the panels. Okay, so here today we have installed 12 450 watt Canadian solar panels, which gives us a total of 5.4 kilowatt peak hours on the roof. And as you can see on the roof, we had to factor in multiple shading elements. And so to do that, we then for well, SunGrow have the full package, right? They've got the optimizers, per panel optimizers. So like uh, very few leading brands in the industry at the moment, SunGrow are one of those many few that do the entire package for optimization. So when we're considering shading as a big factor, SunGrow is a perfect fit and uh, an affordable price. You don't have to have the SunGrow optimizers with a SunGrow installation. You can just have the inverter and the battery and charger, EV charger, and it will work fine but you won't see those extra benefits that you'll get from the optimizers. So what are those benefits? So installing SunGrow optimizers can increase your generation by up to 30%. They improve safety by offering rapid shutdown, which drops the voltage down to 30 volts within 20 seconds. Now we've tested it here and we actually got one volt per module and we've got 12 modules. So we actually got 12 volts on a rapid shutdown. So it provides modular level data with 10 second fast refresh rate. And obviously that's great in terms of fault finding and troubleshooting and for people that are just interested in the analytical tracking of the system at modular level. And thanks to the shade optimized technology, you're able to mitigate any of those shading uh, impedances on your array at modular level, which obviously keeps your output power up and your performance high. So if we open up the system on the SunGrow app, we can actually see what these panels are producing. So I'll take you in, let's have a look. Okay, so as you can see, the entire system is producing 2.43 kilowatts right now, which is obviously made up of these per panel generations. And you can see the shading on those three panels uh, just behind this tree. And we can see the difference in performance from the panels in shade and the panels outside of shade. And equally, we can spot problems with panels like here on 129, which we believe may be 40, or there's something wrong with the optimizer. But ultimately, we can investigate that one panel 
And that's something that because of this now, this level of monitoring, I can see very clearly what panel it is, where it is. I can jump up, have a look. And, you know, for us, that was really easy for us to find. And obviously this is exactly what the app allows you to do. And by having that per panel data is exactly what we want to see when we're identifying generation, identifying uh, problems and so on. So, okay, so what would happen if we didn't have the optimizers on the system? Well, solar panels in series only generate as well as the lowest performing panel. So in this instance, where we have that 40 panel that is currently producing zero watt, this homeowner's entire system would be currently down and he wouldn't be seeing any benefits. But as we have the SunGrow optimizers installed, that isn't the case. As you can see, we are currently generating 2.4 kilowatt. But for argument's sake, let's say that the panel that is 40 was also generating and it was producing more or less the same as the panel next to it, so 150 watt, we would have a total current generation of let's say 2.55 kilowatt. Whilst panels will still generate in shade, the performance of the panel is dramatically reduced. Now the lowest performing panel is 146 watts. Which is the heavily shaded one. So if we didn't have optimizers, then each panel's performance would drop down to 146 watts. So our system would instead only be generating 1.75 kilowatts right now, which does work out to be more or less 30%. So you can see right here and now one of the many benefits of installing solar panel optimizers and the SunGrow ecosystem as we are able to maximize the generation of each panel. It's not just shading as well, right? Because it's to do with startup voltages, as we've said, it's to do with safety. But, you know, the startup voltage is less with a system like this because the panels need less voltage individually to start up. So all of these factors allow for a greater generation over a period of time. So what's also really nice is that you can also click on each panel and get further data. And of course, for me, this is one of the main selling points for SunGrow. Not only their strong history as a brand, but the transparency within the app, which not many other brands offer. So another benefit with the SunGrow app is that it updates every three seconds, which for some of you who have already got solar will know that most systems are every five minutes. So a three second interval is perfect. You can obviously uh, view it on either web or app base and uh, yeah, brilliant. So now let's take you inside to have a look. Okay, so here is our system. And uh, as you can see, we've got lots of components. We've got batteries, we've got an inverter, we've got switch gear and meters. So this is our inverter. So it is the SunGrow optimized hybrid inverter, which is specifically designed to work alongside their optimizers. SunGrow have a range of inverters on single phase from three kilowatt up to six kilowatt. We've gone for the six kilowatt uh, even though we've only got 5.4 kilowatt of PV, um, we've used one tracker, it's got a two track inverter, we've used one of those. The inverter can take 13 kilowatt of PV, so we've got loads of room there um, to expand in the future. We've got a tracker available. Those MPPTs actually have a wide range um, and a low voltage startup, so they're 40 volt up to 560 volt. Really nice wide range. Um, so what does an inverter do? An inverter effectively converts direct current to alternating current. So from our panels, which generate DC power, it comes into our inverter, is converted to alternating current using our home. It's a hybrid inverter because it's also doing that same task, but for the battery DC power as well. So we've got DC batteries, DC panels, both being converted to alternating current via a hybrid inverter. Um, it has a Wi-Fi data logger, which also is a LAN connection as well. So rather than having separate dongles, which some manufacturers do, it's uh, one component that will allow us to either hardwire or use the Wi-Fi. 
Um, it does have the ability to work with a backup generator as well. So EPS, emergency power supply, is available on this inverter. In backup mode, you can benefit from 27.3 amps of power. You can set a SOC value on the monitoring platform. And when the battery reaches that state of charge, the inverter will switch on the generator to recharge your batteries, which is a nice added layer of protection. And yeah, that is our hybrid range. Now, obviously they do a three phase range with loads of uh, much bigger sizes. Um, and there probably will be scope for bigger single phase ones in the UK. But for now, this is what we've got. Then we've got our other components. So we've also got a meter, which is uh, taking a reading using a CT clamp to talk to the inverter, to tell the inverter when to charge and discharge. So that all comes as part of the inverter kit. As you can see, the inverter is quite nice, small and compact, which is lovely. It's got a DC isolator on the inverter. We've then got our batteries. Now, these are probably the first battery to go into the UK uh, of this range which is their brand new range it's the sungro sbs battery so each battery is 5.12 kilowatt hours so that gives us a total of 15.36 kilowatt hour of storage uh, we can get a charge and discharge on that of three kilowatt uh, they are a high voltage battery so they do have isolation switches on the battery themselves so you've got your normal dc battery breaker and uh, on and off switching. Um, you can put those in a uh, maximum of four batteries. So we've got three here, obviously with the space and what we needed, but you can have up to four of those. Um, what else is there I can tell you about it? They're IP rated. So both the inverter and the battery have an IP65 rating, which means they are suitable for both indoor and outdoor installation. Each battery module utilizes 32 LFP cells. So lithium iron phosphate, and they are the most commonly used battery technology at the moment for safety, durability, reliability, um, and efficiency. So pretty standard now in terms of battery. And is there anything else worth knowing about it? They both have 10 year warranty. So uh, I think really that will conclude everything that there is really to know about Sungro. Obviously, um, we discussed about Sungro being new to the UK and uh, we're going to see a lot more of this stuff going into homes. I'm pretty sure that questions are going to come up as that happens and um, maybe this video will become useful. And if you have questions, don't forget to leave them in the comments. And also, if you want to head over to our website, we do have a Sungro exclusive package on the website. And on that package, you can get a free Sungro EV charger as part of your ecosystem. So don't forget to head over and have a look at that. We're really excited and really happy with, the, with this installation, to be honest with you. From software to hardware, everything has gone really well and um, I'm really pleased with it. I look forward to seeing your comments. So don't forget to like, subscribe and follow and keep thinking green and we will see you on the next video. Thank you.